We're here in Washington, D.C., where leaks are usually national news, but tonight we're talking about leaks in water. Right behind me, you'll see a job that's happening right here on a busy thoroughfare on 16th Street. HDPE pipe is being used to slip line an existing failing steel line. The material is fused together and then pulled inside the existing steel pipeline. Once installed, leak free and maintenance free for 100 years. The job involves slip lining 402 feet of 36 inch steel pipe. We're slip lining inside of it 400 feet of 30 inch high density polyethylene pipe. The pipe is lowered into the ditch. It is then grabbed by the machine, which has four jaws. The process is known as butt fusion. The way that the fusion is done is that the jaws grab each side of the fusion point on the pipe and uh, bring them together. The ends of the pipe are then cleaned and scraped and faced off to expose new material. You then pull the pieces of pipe apart, you put the heater plate in, and you heat up the ends of the pipe to between 425 and 450 degrees Fahrenheit. After the pipe has been subjected to the heat, then you take the heater plate out and the pipe is put together under the fusion pressure. Then there's a time of cooling, which in this particular case is a minimum of 32 minutes, after which we then take the machine away from the fusion, we slip the next section into the steel pipe, and we repeat the cycle until we've fused the 400 feet we need. As you can see from the process behind me, the HDP pipe material is ideal for slip lining existing water lines. Traffic is still moving, residents don't lose water, the crews will be out of here in time for morning rush hour. For more information on HDPE Pipe, visit pepipe.org.